What's up? It's me, Merrick Sal, back with another video. I'm going to put a disclaimer out there. If you hear any random noises, if you hear like a TV or dogs barking, that's just how my life is right now. And, uh, yeah. Um, I'm going to be making a new schedule. Um, at, um, I don't know. I'm going to be, this Saturday is not really working out for me, so I'm going to be posting, um, all throughout the week except for Tuesdays and Saturdays so you get a video from me every single day except for Tuesdays and Saturdays because those are my really 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 tough days for me to get a video out there on those days but yeah today's video is going to be a um, how I do my eyebrows video this is how I do it you probably could have told um, seen from the title or whatever but uh I'm just gonna stop talking and let's get on with the video Okay guys, so we're gonna get started. Sorry my voice comes a little bit crazy, but look at me, those are my eyebrows before they have any product on them. That's just my bare eyebrows. So um yeah. Most people don't believe me when I say that I do fill in my eyebrows, but I do. Now this is just an angled brush that I use to apply the powder. The um, powder that I use is from Ulta. It's like an eyeshadow quad thing. And I use this Ulta eyebrow pencil. And it has a spoolie. And then the lid just fell off. But uh, there's that. I don't know what that is for. Oh yeah. I use my beauty blender. It is really dirty. But don't mind that. And then some concealer. And that fell as well. So. Now I'm going to film myself again, you know, just filming myself. Then I'm going to take the brush and the eyeshadow and use the one that is already, like, you can see the metal part. So, yeah, I just do that and then I dip it in there and then I just follow, like, the outline of my brow. But when I do it, I do it in little, like, little strokes. Then we're just gonna speed this along because it's just the same thing. You just fill it in and then just fill it in. And then I'm just using a spoolie to like clean it up a bit. Okay, so I took that pencil and then in, I'm just using that and I'm just filling in like the parts where there are blanks and whatever and I'm using it as I do it. I'm doing it in like little like hair strokes. Oh lord. Yeah, I'm doing it in little hair strokes to make it look more natural. And I do the same thing to the other brow and we're just going to speed this along because it's the same steps over and over and over again so yeah and the pencil is from Ulta if you're wondering it's in the color brown so um yeah and then I use the other end and it's a spoolie and I just clean up the um outside like the inner part right there to make it look more like faded that faded look but I don't really do like from that really light faded to the dark but that's just the way I like my eyebrows, and I'm feeling myself again. Don't mind me. Okay. So then I take these two brushes. These are just two concealer brushes. And then I take some concealer. Yep, there we go. Um, I ended up not using the concealer. As you can see, I'm trying to use it, but 
the, I recommend using like if you have like a liquid concealer that works a lot better than the concealer that I have right now I ended up using my uh, foundation to clean it up so uh, yeah what this step does it just cleans you use it to like clean up the edges like if you messed up and as you can see there like it was not working out at all whatsoever so then I just was like uh, no thank you and then we just try to look for our conce uh, concealer we try to look for our foundation but I had a hard time finding it because I forgot where it was so uh, yeah if you hear any other background noises I'm sorry for that it's just like the world right now so uh, yeah I'm still looking for my foundation looking 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 and I just speeded this process up because it's just looking for foundation okay so in the next clip there you go I found my foundation yay so I feel like I sound like a dude right now but yeah so I'm gonna just take the same brush that I tried to use for the concealer and I'm gonna dip it in the top part of the foundation and I'm just gonna sculpt the eyebrow out make it look all perfection make it look all good and stuff you see the fleek of the brow and uh yeah we just use that and this can like fix the per imperfections like if you messed up or anything you just use that and then we just use that to sculpt out the brow and uh yeah that's all that is to that part Now we're just spreading this out and like making it look less as uh, whatever. Now I'm going to take the beauty blender, my damp beauty blender, and I'm just going to use it to blend it all out so it won't just be like lines on your face. So, yeah. And then we're going to take this other brush thing that I saw I mean that you guys saw and you just use it to blend to finish blending and to clean up the other parts where the foundation probably didn't clean up or didn't blend or anything and um, yeah that's what that part is for And then I just went in again with that same um, angled brush that we used for the powder. And I just did it and I just cleaned up some parts. And then I'm using my finger to tap it to like blend it even some more. I don't know, I just felt like doing that. So, yeah. Now this is the finished look. You see the flick of the brow. Like, look at how good it looks. You know, it's how you snatch someone. Look at how cute. Okay, okay, okay. Now I just picked up the camera because the camera fell. But I'm just using this little brush thingy majigger. I don't know where I got it from, but I'm just using that and it moves a thing. And I don't know why I decided to brush out my eyelashes, but I know I got some foundation in there, so I guess that's what I was using in that for. But yeah end of the video i hope you guys really enjoyed it don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up comment down below what other videos you guys would like to see me make and um also put on your notifications like there's a little bell next to the subscribe button F click that too as well so don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications button it's right next to the thing you'll get notified every single time you every, you post a video every single time that i post a video 
So, um, yeah, I'm just going to stop talking, and I'll just see you in my next video. Bye!